Sometimes they can't go to a regular school. Sometimes they are in the school. But they would like to do something different. They have a wish. And the purpose of Make-A-Wish Foundation is to help make that wish come true. So Make-A-Wish once started about 30 years ago. I think we're in our 31st year. And it was started by a woman, Joan Mazik, who, after she lost her daughter, her young daughter, decided to start an organization because she fulfilled a wish that her daughter had. And that's what we've been doing ever since. Make-A-Wish is a national organization, so there are Make-A-Wish chapters all over the United States doing the same things that we're doing in Colorado. All of the money that we raise in Colorado are only for Colorado wishes. So when we raise money in Colorado, like from your group, that would go to help grant the wishes of other Colorado kids. As I said, we're in our 30th anniversary. We have granted, how many wishes do you think we've granted? Yes? Mm -hmm. A million. A million? That would be great. Yes? Two thousand. Okay, that's close. A little higher. Two hundred thousand? No, a little lower. Yes? One thousand. That's exactly. <laughs> this year, we are going to grant our 4,000 wish. And I'm hoping that your group at Grayland will help us grant that 4,000th wish. Every year, we grant about 250 wishes. So those of you that are math wishes can figure out how many wishes. Anyway, an average cost of a wish is $7,500. Now, that could seem like a lot of money, does it, to anybody, to collect? Yes? Oh, sorry, but uh, what's the usual wish that they ask Okay. The wishes come in four different categories. One of the categories is, I wish to go. So, a lot of our kids who when we grant wishes, want to go to Disney World. Have you all gone to Disney World? Yeah. Okay. Well, we send our families to Disney World. We'll send the wish child, if they have brothers or sisters, a mom or dad or guardian. We will send them for a week. Everything is paid for. They don't have to do a thing. We give them a place to stay. We give kids the World Village. They get to go to Disney World. And do you remember standing in long lines at Disney World? Yeah. Well, our wish kids get to wear a wish, a make a wish button, something like this. And luckily, we let them go to the front of the line. Because many of them can't be in the sun, they can't wait a long time. So that's a special thing that we can do for them. So another wish is called, I wish to have. So I had a wish child, a young boy, about your, how old are you guys? 12, 13? About all ages, okay. eight through. Right. So um, Daniel was uh, nine years old, and he wanted to have Toy Story party, a birthday party. Now that might seem very like, what's the big deal? But Daniel had never had a big party, and he wasn't able to always feel good when he was having his birthday. So it was very special for him to be able to invite his friends, his family. People flew in from other states, and we had this big party for Daniel. A Toy Story party. So I have a nine-year-old grandson, so I know about Toy Story. Does everybody know about Toy Story? Yeah. So there was Buzz, and somebody was dressed up as Buzz. And who was the other character? Woody. Woody, yeah. somebody. And the third character?
character. The pig. The green guy. Oh, the dinosaur. The soldier. Oh. So who do you think dressed up as the soldier? You. I was totally green. And we came in, and Danny was completely surprised. And it was a great birthday. And nobody else had ever seen it. I had to watch Toy Story about four times to make sure I knew everything to do. The uh, soldier didn't have many lines to read. I didn't have much to say except just look good and green. Then we have, I wish to be. That's another wish. So we had a wish child that loved Spider-Man. And the wish was to be a star Spider-Man movie. So we had kids who wrote the script and put it together and we got a movie director and a producer and somebody to film it and we had car chases and all kind of stuff and we had costumes <coughs> and then we had a real actor who played Spider-Man in the movies come. So that was a wish of I want to be. And then the fourth kind of wish is I wish to meet. So we had a big football star with the Broncos last year. He's no longer with us. He's in mm -hmm. the Jets. But <clears throat> they wish to meet Tim Tebow. And the wish got started, and that wish child went on the field, on Broncos Field, met Tim Tebow, met the Broncos, went into the locker room before the game, was introduced to the crowd. So basically those are the four <coughs> kinds of wishes. I wish to go, I wish to have, I wish to be, and I wish to meet. And that's what we're talking about for you, because you are going to be what I am. I'm a wish granter, so I meet with the children, and I get to grant their wishes. You will be wish granters as well, because when you raise some money and do something for Make-A-Wish, you are helping make wishes come true. We have a program. Are there any questions about that? How many do you raise? 250 wishes each year. Okay, let's think about some questions um, about how as, as Penny Harvest, if we were to consider Make-A-Wish donating some of our penny, like how much could help, where it could go to. Can we think of some questions we could ask in that sense, especially some of you who've been leaders before in Penny Harvest? One wish could cost $7,500. The important thing to know is that you don't have to raise $7,500. A lot of our donations come in small amounts. They might be $5, they might be $10, $100, whatever it is. We take pennies, nickels, quarters, whatever you want to do. Yes? Um, so would our, would our money go to that wish, or would our money go to um, a variety? Or? Well, you can do a couple of things. You could raise money for Make-A-Wish and put that into the Make-A-Wish fund. Or you can adopt a wish. Grading in school. Adopt a wish. We could give you a poster with a picture of the wish child. Maybe we could get somebody to come and talk to you who is a wish child. And you could raise money specifically for that wish. The I, I was going to tell you about a program, but at, uh, kids, it's called Kids for Wish Kids. And it's basically designed for you guys. So different schools, 
different groups, God bless you, can raise money for Make-A-Wish or to adopt a specific wish, like you say. And one of the things, my grandson is at a uh, school where 